2009 Small Craft Simulator. STS 2009 is the first simulator in the Russian Federation for training of small craft navigators as well as Coast Guard rescuers and Marine Patrol inspectors. The purpose. The simulator STS 2009 is designed in conformity with national and international standards and is intended for training and demonstration of competence of navigators of sea-going and inland waterways small crafts. Simulator is realized in several versions. The difference among them lies in different sets of navigational areas, ship models, contents of standard exercises and methodological indications on the simulator training. Features STS-2009 is a new generation simulator developed with the use of the most advanced computer technologies, high-quality visualization of exercise area and physical models of ships, allows students to work out exercises and conditions close to reality. Ergonomics and ease of interface of instructor workplace allows mastering the functionality of the software and begin the educational process in the shortest time. Some words about the configuration of our simulator. The simulator consists of the instructor workplace software and one of several students' workplaces. Students' workplaces can be presented in base or compact configuration. Base configuration includes steering stand with built-in steering wheel, sensor control panel and visualization system on the projection apparatus or LCD panels. Compact configuration includes steering stand and visualization system of the surface plant, which come out on the display of the monitor. Steering is carried out with the help of joystick and mouse. Functional features of the software The instructor workplace the instructor workplace manages the process of training of the student. The instructor workplace can also be displayed on the big LCD panel. The instructor provides choice of exercises which contain area of navigation. STS 2009 contains such areas as sea area, a district approach from the seaport, and the areas of inland waterways. Exercises contain hydrometeorological conditions, time of the day, placement and trajectory of the target vessels, overload situations. Instructor provides adjusting the initial parameters of exercises, such as changes of the navigational situation, installation of navigational signs, changes of hydrometeorological conditions, such as strength and direction of wind, reduced visibility, precipitation, wave height and time of the day, entry of new target vessels. Model selection and placement of student ships. Active models of the simulator are a motorboat, a cutter, a pleasure craft, a wave runner, and marine petrol vessel. The target models are Three models of merchant vessels more than 4,010 gross tonnage and a sailing yacht. Visual control of the students' exercising. With the help of virtual cameras, it's possible to observe any part of the navigation area and on the bridge of the active ship from any angle. Active management of the students' vessel. This function may be necessary to demonstrate the proper performance of the exercise and recording of the exercise for the debriefing. Student Workplace Student Workplace provides the student with the opportunity of multiple fulfillment of the exercises set by Instructor Workplace and improvement of practical skills. Student Workplace imitates Steering stand with built-in steering wheel Engine control, throttle gears Sensor control panel, including magnetic compass Navigational lights control buttons Tachometer Electronic chart and the visualization of the surrounding surface situation. Basic simulated exercises of the SCS 2009 simulator Start up and shut down of the boat, small craft handling and maneuvering, basic high and low speed operations, rules of the road. Entering harbors at day and night. A 
and green green steering a course and use of magnetic compass propulsion equipment and celebration boat handling in restricted waters eastern maneuvering high speed maneuvering maneuvering in high sea conditions towing onboard equipment failures and man overboard search and recovery.